The 70th annual Flag Day Parade here in Appleton is back on after being canceled last year due to the coronavirus pandemic. The reason? Projected vaccinations and a downward trend in COVID. Eric Richards, Local 5 News in Green Bay. As more and more people get vaccinated in the fight against the coronavirus pandemic, the Catholic Church is calling for the... Well, did you know that there is a level of government working 24-7 to ensure the safety and well-being of all Wisconsinites? It's our county government, and they're your neighbors working alongside you and for you. Checking our top stories this morning, Wisconsin is seeing a decline in COVID-19 hospitalizations throughout the state. The DHS reports the number of people in the hospital due to the virus has dropped to under 250. However, 13 more people have died from the virus, which is an increase from the previously zero reported deaths and more than 460 new cases of COVID-19 were reported. The direct payments from President Biden's COVID relief plan are already hitting bank accounts this weekend. The IRS says that there is no reason to be concerned if you do not see the direct payments in the next few days. They are going out in batches and the paper checks will take a little on five this morning. Wisconsin is seeing a decline in COVID-19 hospitalizations throughout the state. The DHS reports the number of people in the hospital due to the virus has dropped to under 250. However, 13 more people have died from the virus, which is an increase from the previously reported zero deaths and more than 460 new cases of COVID-19 were reported. Wisconsin. Eric Richards, Local 5 News in Green Bay. The cancellation of the NCAA tournament last March due to the COVID-19 pandemic cost millions of dollars. Local businesses, though, here are getting ready to welcome NCAA fans back this year. A few safety guidelines in place with more people getting vaccinated, though some businesses say that it will be a safer environment.